For my presentation discussion, I decided to do a little bit more research on Diana Baumrind and um, her discoveries of the different parenting styles. She was a developmental psychologist that was born in 1927, and she was best well known, most well known for her um, research on three specific different parenting styles. These different styles include permissive parenting, authoritarian parenting, and authoritative parenting. Um, an easy way that I like to imagine these different um, styles is just on a line with permissive and authoritarian parenting on either end of the line with uh, authoritative right in the center. So I want to introduce both what these parents look like and the effects that these styles have on their children. Permissive parenting would likely be represented by the cool parents. The ones who are like your friends, your hangout, like everyone likes to go hang out at their house because they don't have any rules and the parents are fun. Um, so these parents have few, if any, boundaries or rules. The child has little responsibility and ultimately the parent is seen as a friend rather than a guide or a teacher. This lack of consistency and routine is harmful to the development of children. While it is beneficial and necessary for all children to develop their autonomy, um, their identity, finding themselves, um, children of permissive parents often develop too much autonomy where they don't have um, impul impulse control. It has also been found that these children have lower academic achievement than the children of authoritative parents. On the opposite side of the line, we have authoritarian parenting. These parents are strict and demanding. They have lots of different rules um, and they hold very high expectations for their children. This parent values obedience and has little tolerance for any opposition. The child must think and act as the parents do. Um, because their way is the way, the only way. Um, <laughs> so these parents often use physical punishment as a way to achieve this obedience from their children and, and their parents demand respect. So children of this parenting style do not search for autonomy and therefore look to their parents for answers. Um, they fear that they can't make the right choice. Their parents have always told them what the right thing to do it or what what they would like them to do and they've always followed. So they tend to be dependent, passive, conforming, less self-assured, less creative, and less socially adept than other children. They are also at higher risk for substance abuse, crime, and delinquency, and they are deprived of the opportunities to practice skills of compromise and conflict resolution in relationships. These parents have a hugely negative impact in their children's futures. Authorita authoritative parenting sits right in the middle and is recognized as the most, help most healthy style. Parents do guide their children, but they also allow them to make their own choices. This allows for autonomy. The parent affirms the child's present qualities, but also sets stand standards for future conduct. These parents demonstrate nurturance, discipline, and respect. While they do set expectations for their children, they have open communication so the, under the children can understand the reasons behind the rules that their parents have set for them. Children raised by authoritative parents show higher levels of familial interaction. They feel heard and understand uh, and understood when they discuss their thoughts, feelings, and the reasons behind their behaviors. These children show higher levels of academic achievement, higher levels of self-esteem, and have better relationships with peers, siblings, and adults. Their psychosocial development is more mature as well. This shows that they have higher levels of resourcefulness, reasoning ability, and empathy. 
Overall, the benefits from authoritative parenting are far better than those of permissive or authoritarian parenting styles. So Diana's um, research has shown both what parents can do, um, better ways to parent the children, um, and has also sh explained and um, found the research behind how these children are influenced by the way they are parented.